Hi guys, welcome back to the acoustic guitar tutorial of the song Concrete from Lovejoy. Uh, I covered this song way back on the guitar, uh, which was on the electric, but just thought of making one acoustic version uh, in which I like to combine the chords and the riffs together and play it while strumming, which makes it sound a lot more nicer. So here we got the keyboard on fret 3. Uh, you can have a look at my channel playlist. I have covered almost every single song by Lovejoy. Check it out, let me know how it was. Uh, now this song stands in keep on fret 3. Let's quickly have a look at the three main chord shapes. Yes, just three chords, that's the whole song. First chord the C major, mute 3 to open first open. Then we have an A minor 7, which is mute open second open first open. Then we have an F major 7, which is mute mute 3 to 1 open. If you want, you can add your thumb on the E1 uh, just to add the bass if you want. Alright. Now I want to jump straight into the melody, the main riff which we have. So it basically goes like this. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be following chord progression which starts off with the C major chord, right? So hold the C major chord and make sure you have a plectrum on your right hand and now we're going to go for this. So you are holding a C major chord, but at the same time, you have your pinky fixed on the third fret of the high E string. C major with the pinky on fret 3 of E. So we're going to go for a jam up stroke. So let's go for a jam up. Now let's remove the pinky and play the C major chord normally. Jam up. And now let's add the pinky on fret 3 of B and do the exact same thing. Jam up. And now let's remove the B string, 3rd fret, the pinky and make it normal C. So there's not any such case of just hitting this string or that string. You're gonna be strumming the full chord but make sure you place your fingers, the pinky properly to play the melody. So we got down up, down up, down up, down up. Repeat that. Now the next chord which we have is the A minor 7. So it will be exactly same, just remove your ring finger. From the third of the A string, that's an A minor 7, yeah. Now do the exact same melody. Down up, down up, down up, down up. And this time we have a change when we play for the fourth time. So we're going to be doing a down up in the same way. Pinky on fret 3. Then remove the pinky. And then instead of moving to B3, we're going to be moving to 5 on E. I know it's a bit stretchy, but please try to put your pinky on fifth fret of the high E string. I'm going to go for a down up. So we have and then just remove your pinky and play down up normally on the A minor 7 chord. So here we go. Sorry, from the beginning. See that? Down up, down up, down up, down up. And then go back to C major chord and play the exact same thing. Down up, down up, down up. So we'll repeat it twice, C major two times. And then we go to the F major chord, what we do? So I hold the F major 7 chord and I do one dance stroke uh, till the B string and at the same time I like to do a hammer on on the G string 2nd fret. So though we have the G string 2nd fret in that F major 7 chord, but I like to do the hammer on. Then you hit the B string and I do G B G B G B couple of times. You can even just strum down up, down up, down up. That would be better, but I can just keep the high E string made for this part. So we have down, 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 down up, down up, down up, down up. So all put together, the main part of the song sounds like this. Now throughout the whole song, uh, the chord progression will be a C major, then an A minor 7, and then an F major 7, and then again F major 7. So when the riff comes, you play that stop which I just showed you right now, otherwise throughout the whole song, you just do one dance stroke for the part, or when it comes to be like a bit more chorus stuff, you can just go a fourth dance stroke in every chord following the chord progression, and there you have it. But 
don't think the tempo is that much fast. It will be a bit slower. So. That's the whole song guys. I hope this video helps you out. Let me know what other songs you just want to learn on the guitar. Uh, that's it. I'll see you guys back in the next one. Till then bye.